400. Questions for Brian. So Brian, how are you feeling physically? Uh, I feel really good right now. Uh, coming off this hamstring injury is, is definitely a, a good feeling. And, uh, you know, I have soreness here and there and tightness, but that's understandable with the type of injury that it was. And I've just been working really hard with the trainers and with our, uh, our weightlifting coach, Chris Holder, and getting myself to the, the highest level possible that I can and still being able to um, strengthen and have mobility in it as well as uh, having enough strength in there to play and to not re-injure it. And that's probably our biggest uh, concern right now. And, and that's the goal to, to play the rest of the season, keep it healthy, and keep it loose and, and stuff like that. Was it difficult sitting out and watching the team play? Absolutely. Yeah, I mean, uh, since I've been at Cal Poly, I, I, haven't, uh, I haven't sat out pretty much any uh, since my freshman year or since I even started playing. And, and it was really hard. And especially with the, the type of games that we were having in the, in the season, the way it was going, it was, it was rough uh, having to sit back and know that I can't do anything to, to help the team out, to help my teammates. And, and you know, I, it gave me a good opportunity to kind of sit back and, and see how the big picture of our team worked and see what we had to work on as a team and, and being able to communicate with guys one-on-one -on, -one on what I see and and how what I say I think can help them and, and stuff like that. So it was a good opportunity for me to kind of, um, I don't know, help our team out in a different way. But it's definitely a lot better playing. And, and being able to, to be in the game on Sunday, was, there was no better feeling. Brian, does this almost feel like a fresh start for you guys because of the disappointing start and you, you finally have you know, as close to a full roster as you've had all year, and, and, and you and, and Mark both back healthy. Absolutely. I mean, it's uh, it's always good to, to, you know, come back from injury and, and have success right after your first game back and stuff like that. So for me, it's just a, it's a good feeling to just to be able to have the opportunity to be out there and play. And, and I feel like with uh, the good series that we had this weekend against Sac State, and uh, we have three series coming up that should be a, the biggest test that I think we've had since I've been at Cal Poly. And if we have some good success in there, that just leads on into conference and the rest of the season. So I think this is our time for a fresh start. And, and having that good feeling going into this weekend is the best thing for us. Did you expect uh, to knock the rust off as quickly as you did on Sunday? Uh, I wasn't sure. You know, I was just kind of going in there and trying to stick to the approach that I had before I, I got injured and, and just putting the barrel on the ball. And I was lucky enough to, to get into a couple of them. So. Uh, it was nice to know that that I was back, and it kind of gave me a little bit of confidence in my leg and in the, the way that uh, I can play with the injury not being completely 100% healthy, but good enough to play. So um, it was good. But you know, this week has been really focused on getting myself back to 100% and healthy. So hopefully, it, uh, it's just going up from here. What's the excitement level you personally, team-wise, of, of getting USC here into Baggett this weekend? You know, I, I'm always excited to play really good competition, uh, especially with the team that's top 10 in the nation. It just gives, gives you the opportunity for greatness, if you ask me. And, and that's what every great athlete strives for. And it gives you the pressure to, to produce and, and be able to, you know, knock off a team like that out of the top 10. And, you know, I respect USC as a team and I respect the players that they have. And obviously it's going to be great playing at home and having our fans behind our back and everything like that. So I think it's just going to be a great series. And being able to play at a competition level that high is, you know, what we play baseball for and what we strive for. So uh, I'm just really excited for this weekend. And then once this weekend's over, I'm just excited to, to move on to the next weekend. Communication.